Hello everyone, good morning, good evening, whatever you may be. My name is Endar, and welcome back to Elite Dangerous. And at my own risk, I shall enter. Uh, the wars are over in both LTT5455 and Turretani. And uh, they have ended in decisive Dark Wheel victories. And that is good news for us. However, the uh, evacuations still continue at our uh, various stations that need assistance. Damn it. Let me get landed and I can uh, show you just what all has happened that has heated up this storyline. Yes, I'd like to be pulled back down where it's relatively cooler. And, uh, oh my, the story has heated up quite a bit. Because, uh, Isling Duval's brother has been assassinated. Prince Harold Duval assassinated. Prince Harold Duval is dead after a targeted assassination attempt by the neo marlinist Liberation Army. The Empire has imposed a media blackout on these events, and no official statement has been made. However, Independent journalist Gwendolyn Nash published this on the scene report for Vox Galactica. From interviewing multiple sources, we gather that a single assassin managed to infiltrate Harold Duval's personal transport. He was killed by shipboard guards, but not before she had mission critical message. Shooting the prince at close range. The MMLA claimed responsibility for this attack in its latest propaganda broadcast, which referred to the Duval family. Mission critical message. The as imperialist parasites. The extremist group also demanded that Marlinists set up a mission critical message. I forgot that that interrupts the news. The Democratic Republic. Harold Duval was famously declared unfit for the throne by Emperor Hengist and has been out of the Eagling mission critical message. Rikai ever since. He rarely left capital but was making an unpublicized journey to visit his daughter Ashling Duval, presumably in response to the recent terrorist attack in the Samir system. It remains unknown how the NMLA knew of the Prince's itinerary, or managed to breach security on his ship. Yes, so uh, things have definitely heated up. The uh, brother of the Empress is dead. Long live the Empress. And uh, conspiracy theories abound. Everything from Isling Duval herself ordered the assassination. To, I believe, her aunt having kicked off the assassination. But regardless, uh, plot and plot and powder is definitely the word of the day. Plot and treason, the gunpowder season, whatever the whatever the rest of the rhyme goes. I see no reason why the gunpowder trees should ever be forgot. There we go. That's the one. I think. I'm not 100% sure. I'm not British. But anyway, I thank you all for watching. Feel free to uh, like, comment, and subscribe, and click that little bell for notifications, and to join me in my eternal crusade against YouTube and its sorting algorithms. And hopefully, I will see you all in the next video.